So there's a lot of competition just now in the creative industries to attract the best talent into your business. And there's never really been a, a more challenging time for small agencies like ours. Employees, you know, they always want more stuff. And, you know, I'm, I'm always trying to figure out, you know, how do I work around that? I read an article in The Scotsman recently that showed that having an office dog decreases stress in the office by about 42% and increases serotonin levels by over 132.6%. We have an office dog, you know, and that, that's fine. And, and I was thinking, what can I really do to push that boundary? There tends to always be a little bit of friction when it comes to new ideas. You know, people aren't always on board as fast as you, you, you might like. So I've kind of had to sort of coax them along a bit so, so Joanne, I really just wanted to, to get this call together to kind of find out what... what, Sorry, what what's that? I can't quite hear you. What's that noise? Joanne, can you hear me better now? No, what is that clucking? Uh, no, no, no. Just, um, it's, oh, it's, still there? Yeah, I'm here. Sorry, I, I just have a I have a cough, and and I think actually it's kind of it's something that's going round round the office. But hey, you know, these are the chances you have to take. For us, we've been able to create new job roles, things the guys can put on their CVs, add to their portfolios. As well, we're finding new opportunities, new revenue streams that just weren't there before. And now what we're finding is that not only has stress dramatically decreased in the office, but we're also seeing a seven to one return on our investment. I, again, you know, we're still working out some of the kinks. There's been a few speed bumps, mostly been plain sailing. Really expecting to see more businesses follow suit with similar initiatives as soon as the data goes mainstream. You know, I think we've built something really great here. People like to say that we're crazy. I prefer to say we're brave.